Hey guys, welcome back. Here we go again. Yeah. I want to talk about Kim Kardashian. One dangerous woman. But I don't care about none of her lifestyle or none of that. That ain't got nothing to do with it. Although, that... I mean, that don't really matter. That's not the real reason on why she's single. But this is my whole point. Pointing out what women in general do. They run through men. They play with men. They have children with men. They have no intentions of staying with. Although, I think her excuse was Kanye was going a little crazy. Maybe there's some truth to that. But it don't matter. These women know what they dealing with. They know what kind of man you are when they deal with you. They know what kind of father you will be. They don't know if you're going to be a good father or not. And I'm not talking about a man that's there that takes care of their kids. It's much more to being a father than somebody that can physically do things for the children that need to be done and raise the children you know, have played with the children and all that. It's, it's, a, it's a lot of things we're not doing with our sons, especially. Like, you can just look at Will Smith, kids, in general. Like, we literally need to focus on our young men, especially. But girls benefit also. Because, remember, a father is the first man she learns to respect. A father is the first man she learns how valuable a man is also. She learns respect and the value of a man and all at the same time. But I want to talk about how she chose this man, Kanye West. That was a terrible story anyway. I don't want to talk about that. But in the end, she's a billionaire, which it don't matter. None of that stuff matter when you're single eternally. No man, especially the ones that she would look at to marry, would want a baby mama. I don't care how much money you got. And the men that do see value in you are just looking at your net worth. Because women, I really believe it don't matter how they move. They still, in general, I'm talking about American women, do not understand men. Men understand women a little bit more. In general, men and women don't understand each other. Because remember, in this country, we do not raise our, our sons to be husbands. We don't raise our daughters to be wives. So... We have no clue about this system. So that's how Kim Kardashian is in a terrible situation. This is why I say, what is the point of women's choices? Is her, if her choices is going to leave a man scorned, the children scorned, and then in the end she's going to be scorned, it don't matter. Her choices do not matter. See, we got women that will argue this down as long as they can make some good choices and they feel like their decisions kept them in a good position because there's some women that are happily married. But most women are miserable, especially after 45, I'm going to say. Miserable. Oh, but don't you dare talk about taking away choices from women. Even though it destroys everybody involved, including herself. Even the children. Look at Janet Jackson and her children. They're all suffering. The child, the father, and her. Because women do not understand this system. Heck, I could say most men don't understand it. But at least men, once they realize how bad it is, the ones that truly understand, they get the heck out of this country because they realize... It don't matter what you do, you're going to fail. 
you have like a 95% failure rate of relationships in America because if you start thinking about it, these women leave you in your 60s too. <laughs> it's not over, you thought you made it. Most men that get married, let's say at 30, wife leaving you at 60. Look at Bill Gates, terrible. But yeah, Kim Kardashian, her situation, unless she's going to buy a man, unless she's going to pay for a man, she's going to be single eternally. But you got to understand, women that got money like that think they deserve a high-earning man too. But high-earning men can have any woman. We don't care about your money. We literally want to get a woman where we can show her the world. That is more appealing to us. That makes us feel good. Versus a woman that can walk away with all her money. Yes. This is why we need to get rid of alimony. Because it literally makes men not want to get married. But also her past is terrible too. And then all the different men... Like, I don't think women realize that kind of lifestyle. It sounds fun while you're doing it, but then you're whining in the end. You should realize what it's going to result to being single. Because only a fool would deal with uh, Kim Kardashian. She's looking for a rich sucker. But guess what? These rich men, they ain't looking at her. Anyway, guys, like, comment, and subscribe. Peace.